Let's learn how to do the freeze frame clone trail effect using the CapCut editing app. This is a pretty cool effect that you can use for your videos, and you can do this with only one click of a button. You don't have to make complex edits like we had to a couple of months ago, we can now do it with just one click of a button. So without wasting your time, let's start. The very first step is to make sure that CapCut is updated. So go to the App Store or Google Play Store and make sure that CapCut is up to date. Then open the CapCut editing app and import the video where you want to add the freeze frame effect. I have a great video here of a woman running, and I'll leave the link of this video in the description down below. Now select the video in the timeline and click on the style button here. Now open the scene swap section. If you can't find the effect in here, then go to other sections until you can see a freeze frame effect. You have two different effects here, so select each one and see which one suits you best. When you choose the effect, you can click on the adjust button to select the interval between the two freezes or the start time of the first freeze. And when you finish, you can save the video to your photo gallery. That is how you can create the freeze frame clone trail effect with one click on a button in CapCut. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.